hi hello guys so we are seeing uh, raven db tutorial so uh, last session we sh uh, just show how to set the connection strings so today we are going to see how to open the session and how to push some data into the raven db is uh, today's topic so directly i will go and do the things okay uh, okay i already initialized my data so under that i going to enable the session of the particular store that initialized so for that i just create one variable called session session equal to store dot open the new session that is what open session okay under my open session i going to store some uh, data session dot adding the data use the store store so it asking for the object object equal to new uh, i have already a model called company so i going to add this here so whatever the properties in a company i have i want to add the external id okay external id okay external id actually is a developer so i keep as a developer and fax number so fax number fax number something will give uh, one two slash zero nine slash zero zero something three okay then uh, contact number phone phone number something like okay some ten digit number i just provide us okay then finally the name so name must be a uh, Johnson okay Johnson okay my uh, I filled my object so this object I need to save now so how to do that one it's very simple session dot uh, save the changes so I'll ask the session open session to save the changes then it will be saved uh, automatically by using the save session it's same like an entity framework uh, actually it is like uh, n hibernate technology what we are using but anyways uh, it follows the same entity rule uh, link you method only so it's uh, nothing a uh, big deal there so let's uh, I already kept the breakpoint so i will run the application so let it uh, build so okay meanwhile uh, let it uh, run okay this is my database so already I have on 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 uh, entry called companies uh, slash ID with the HR department is a uh, is a hibernating rhinoceros something I just kept is fax number and the phone number I kept already so now I am trying to add a new document uh, so it's uh, hit at my breakpoint so let's go step over so my connection is got initialized with any error so I'm opening one session and uh, creating the object and saving the object okay let's yes finally it's got saved actually okay let's go and refresh my okay let's uh, so now I am able to see my two companies here before it is a one just refresh this page so already we have anywhere refresh no it is not I just uh, reload the page again yeah here we go so I have a company uh, slash 33 uh, what the name I ordered is Johnson and external ID I gave developer and the fax number and the phone number I added so guys so this is a way to push some record to the rev and DB still my page is loading over there no issue with that uh, anyways data is pushed already 
so guys this is a way to add on entry to the raven db it's very simple you no need to go and create the columns and update the columns oh blah 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 so it's totally avoided uh, if you created a model that is enough to handle everything so guys it's a very good stuff so please follow our tutorial to learn completely the document uh, type database in a dot net that is most preference from the microsoft or raven db so just follow up and get a good updates on this thanks for watching the video guys please subscribe our channel to get a more updates